you want to unban your Xbox 360, first thing you'll need is a Xen card. I have the Xen Neox card with the USB. And to show you that I am banned, I will do the Xbox Live connection test. Alright, everything will go good except for the Xbox Live part. It'll fail right there. Just wait. And then failed. Alright. Now to show you, this account has been banned for the vi for violations of the terms of use. Now you know this console is banned. Alright, now you, what you want to do is turn off your Xbox and plug in the XN card with the USB into the front of the Xbox. Okay, and you want to turn on the Xbox by pressing the red button on the XN card. Hold it down until your Xbox turns on. Just wait a little bit. Alright, now once you see it turn on, uh, before the in intro ends, you want to hold down the white button. It's right next to the red one, and a black screen should come up. And press it three times, and let it load. And once it does, it'll come up with this extract firmware, open firmware, and exit exit firmware. You want to click on open or extract firmware first. And I don't know why, but my TV couldn't fit all the words in all the way. All right now, you'll see a small loading bar. Uh, my camera's kind of fuzzy right now. <clears throat> Alright, it'll go by pretty fast. Once it does, you could take out the USB from your Xbox, or you could turn off your Xbox first, then take out the USB. And then, next thing you want to do is plug it into your computer. So I'm going to do that real quick. And then I'll record from there. Alright, once you have put in the Xen card into your computer, you will need to open up the Xen Toolbox 2.1. Alright, and it's a small program. You could click on Tools, Read Firmware, or you could just click on Read. And just let it load right there. Basically reading the firmware that you extracted from your Xbox. Alright, now you can see it says it's found the firmware and it tells you the serial number of the banned Xbox and it says it's ready to get patched. Now you click in, you could click on patch firmware or you could click on unban. I'm just going to do that. Alright, it's patching the firmware or writing over the firmware. Alright, a little message will pop up to tell you that it was successful. Now you could unplug X, the XN card from your computer. Alright, now plug in the Xen card back into the Xbox 360 again, and you're going to want to turn it on by holding the red button. Alright, once the intro is loading, hold down the white button. Alright, now once you're in that screen, press the white button three times. Alright, let it load, and it'll take you to the other screen. Now click on Open Firmware instead of Extract Firmware, and it'll blink red. Okay, and it'll take you to a loading bar. And this part's going to take a little bit longer than last time, so just wait a little bit. Sorry, my camera's a little bit shaky. I was holding it with one hand, so... Alright, once you finish, you could unplug the Xen card and the Xbox 360 should restart on its own. Okay. Now, I would ch now it should be unbanned. Alright, I'm going to go to the Xbox 360 connection test to go check. Okay, so far so good. Alright, there you go. Xbox Live is working and you can now sign into Live and thanks for watching my video.